something is universal, what does that mean to you? The college in Mount St. Vincent was an instant fit for me. There's just this sort of vibe that's magical. The professors are great. Our students are amazing. They come from very diverse backgrounds. This is a very personal place. I love the close-knit community here in the Mount. There's always something going on. I think that Mount St. Vincent is a wonderful place. I really do. My name is Rima Syed. I'm a biology major here at the College of Mount St. Vincent. I just put ethyl here and propyl here. The small class size is something that really appealed to me. Having about eight to 10 people in my class means it's a very intimate setting with the professor. The environment in the class is a very individualized approach. Keep in mind, we continue the story. The professors learn the names of each student. James, really Getting like to know pieces. about who they are and what their objectives are. I know all my students. I know when they're late, when they're struggling, when they're doing really well. My name is James Puma, I'm a history major. My professors are very helpful, whether it's with homework, a test, even if it's non-school related, if you need to talk to them. My name is Dominic Scipioni, and I'm a history major with a concentration in secondary and special education. It's really important that technology enhances instruction. I went to my professors and said, listen, I really want to improve my grades, what can I do? And they worked with me one-on-one -on -one individually, and I was able to hold the grades up more than a letter grade. Dr. Rollins, my organic chemistry laboratory yeah. professor, is probably one of the most influential professors I've had. Um, I'm Angeline Malave. I'm a nursing major. Okay, great. Your blood pressure is 110 over 80. Nursing is very exciting. It's a lot of reading, and it's a lot of science, um, but I enjoy it. Terrorism revolves around the need for the media. My name is Gabriela Cassano. I'm an English major. They really wanted to make sure to focus on cultural production. The academic program is extremely rigorous. I don't say that to scare anyone. It's just that you're going to be that academically challenged, which is what you want at a higher education institution. The college is a liberal arts college. We really are about educating the whole person. You do have to take a wide variety of courses. The core curriculum really expands your horizons. We emphasize analytical skills and critical thinking. When you are the smartest person in the room, you'll be pretty successful. We emphasize the ability to express oneself orally and in writing. When you are the person who can speak publicly and articulate something, you will be head and shoulders above the rest. Because the college is deeply committed to the legacy of the Sisters of Charity and its identity within the Catholic tradition, we ask everyone to be able to weigh moral and ethical questions seriously. It allows us to think on other levels. It broadens our knowledge in general. That's why we say we don't just prepare you for a job. We prepare you for a career. The campus is very pretty. The scenery at the Mall is really beautiful. I fell in love with the view, the Hudson River, how close it was to New York City. Very, very nice and very relaxing. One of my favorite places is the Quad or the Lawn, which is at the bottom of the campus. They're a big open area. You can do a lot of stuff. People hang out there. Everyone's so kind on campus. Everyone's saying hello, playing ball, integrating with each other. You never felt like there were cliques. Everyone's just friendly with everyone. I love the close-knit community here in the Mount. It's very easy to get involved here on campus. There's so much to do. You're listening to WMSV Media. I got recruited by the baseball coach. Lacrosse is a great sport. I really enjoy playing it. We had our biggest season, which was just an amazing feeling. Everything is located in the pavilion, which is where student activities are. Anyone can go in there and ask about the various different clubs and how to join. But I've joined Filament, which is a hip-hop team on campus. Filament is from Filipino and Element. 
and I've been working so hard to make it more diverse. Hit, hit, cat, touch up. It's open to any student on campus. I'm not the greatest dancer. I've never had any dance experience. If you love to dance, come dance with us. We discuss our formal contracts and proposed to the cap companies that we're going to be working with. I've been in student government for the past two years. Student government is probably one of the greatest organizations you can get involved in. We make this campus stronger. We set up concerts. We set up big events for them to enjoy here in the mouth. We try to support as many people as possible, and we just love to see students getting involved. This is where your soul truly resides, in the empty places of your body. The Underground is the school's literary magazine, and it's a really great community that has editors and writers coming together to form this really wonderful magazine that actually just went international. I'm an RA here in Seton Hall, um, Residence Hall. And one of the biggest things in the RA is my door is always, always open for my residents. The dining facilities are great. There's a few places you can eat on campus. Our dining hall is called Hudson Heights, and there's so many different stations there. There's a pizza station, there's a grill. There's also sushi on Wednesdays, which is something that many students love. They do a good job keeping the variety of food different day by day. Yeah, a lot of students tend to stay in the cafeteria for hours just to socialize. So it's this huge paradox where I feel like I'm in a rural area and then I travel five minutes and I can be in Manhattan. The city's a subway right away, about a 10, 15 minute ride down to Grand Central. And Grand Central's in the middle of the city, so you can get anywhere. Our students are linked to institutions and people in New York City. The internship opportunities available to our students are world class. Recently I went on a midnight run through Campus Ministry. Campus Ministry is where we serve, we lead, and we love. We really take the mission and the charism of the Sisters of Charity and put it into action. Midnight Run's been around for over 25 years is our most successful service project here at the College of Mount St. Vincent. We start in preparation early in the day. We make sandwiches for the poor, and we deliver them after the midnight from the Bronx to Manhattan. We stopped at different corners, and we gave out sandwiches and clothing and shoes and socks, and it was just a very rewarding experience. We have about four stops tonight, and we're back by one or two in the morning. This place is like a second home to me. Everyone here is accepting of each other. It really has prepared me for life. The students that leave here do go on to accomplish some amazing things. We have students that work in some of the most prestigious companies in the United States. I feel like Mount St. Vincent opened up my eyes to a lot of different things. It's not a Darwinian place. It's not do or die. It's that we're in this together. It's a life-changing experience. It's been awesome here. <laughs> the Mount really offers you every opportunity you could possibly imagine. Couldn't ask for anything else. It's a place where all of your dreams will come true. Being at Mount St. Vincent has just been an amazing ride. It's been great.